Hello there. So uh, my uh, outdoor reviews today has uh, just gone out the window because we just had an almighty thunderstorm. If you watched my last uh, polytunnel update, you would have heard it hitting the polytunnel while I was out there. Anyway, so the review is done in the old kitchen again, I'm afraid. Um, so today we're going to try these. You've got Psycho Pickles and Psycho Gherkins. Now let me show you the whole thing. You see, oh, let's get a better view, right. See those red bits in there? They are Naga Boot Jalokia peppers. You've got the same going on. Let's see if I can get a nice view of that. See them floating about with the pickles. Everything's edible. Um, I have had these before about five years ago and um, after eating all the pickles and gherkins I uh, used the peppers to make a burger relish. I made a big batch of burger relish. Um, it was delicious and the vinegar have any fish and chips. You've got spicy vinegar. Lovely. So anyway I think it actually tells you on the jar not to waste it. So let's uh, yeah, it does say here, um, don't throw the chilies away, use them in your cooking, don't throw the vinegar away, use it on your chips. Ingredients, onions, uh, naga jalokia, water, acetic acid, spirit vinegar, and flavouring, and that is going to be the same, the only difference is it's got gherkins in that one. Um, it's a little bright up here, but, alright. Um, Serious pickles for serious chili eggs. The longer you leave, leave them, them, the hotter they get. You may experience pain. Do not panic. Pain facilitates the release of powerful endorphins from within your brain. Endorphins make you feel good. If pain symptoms persist, do not lower your dosage. <laughs> Just quit your whining and have another damn pickle. Hallowed be thy pain. Dr. Bernorium, I think that's the name of the site. I did actually get these off of um, Amazon, but I had bought a lot of products from uh, Dr. Uh, is it Bernorium, it's pronounced. And that's uh, it's got the same write up on it. All right, without further ado, let's eat some pickles. I've got fish and chips for dinner later on. That's why I'm opening these up now. I'm going to have a bit spicy. No, I'm not going to eat the jalokia, I'm going to eat a pickle. Oh, wait, this one's a gherkin actually. I've gone with the gherkins first because if I remember rightly, the pickled onions are very, very strong. It's a gherkin. That's a hot gherkin. Very strong. Mm. And because a lot of it's in that, it's in that vinegar. And uh, I put it straight in my mouth, so it didn't matter like that. Well, it tastes like a gherkin, or a Cornish on, whatever you want to call them. Um, and it tastes like vinegar, but it's spicy. And it's also, it does say it's got flavourings in there. There's something in there. I don't know what they're putting there. It just says flavourings on it. Right, so that's the gherkins. Now on with the bad ones. Now I know these pickles are strong. You know like ones you get in the fish and chip shop? They're a lot stronger than your sweet supermarket pickles. And uh, yeah, these are hot. I think they're hotter than the, uh, than the gherkins. If I remember rightly, oh, I don't want that pen menu all over the place, right? So I'm going to eat this in a couple of bites. Lovely pickle. It's going to be nice fish and chips. Didn't seem as hot as the gherkin, but perhaps I've just adjusted myself to it very quickly. It's warm, I'm sweating because it's humid. We just had a big thunderstorm. Not good.
and it's not just for your fish and chips, your cheese and crackers and whatnot, diamonds. But I have big onions. Let's have a little drop of water. Lips burning. Lips are burning, especially the top lip. A little bit in the back of the throat, um, on the roof of the mouth, and a little bit on the tongue as well. Heat level for those, um, for me, I'm gonna give them a good four, actually, a good four, that's pretty good for me. So if you're not on chili head, you might find them a little bit hot. They're not your average pickles, believe me. Um, but they're delicious, absolutely delicious. Go and check out uh, Dr. Bernor Bernorium, I can never pronounce it properly, Bern Bernorium, that's it. Um, I'll put a link to his site. Um, there's some really, really cool stuff on there, especially the dark art stuff. Go and have a look at the dark art stuff. I did show it in my collection video when I showed you my hot sauce collections in my cabinets. Yeah, uh, I've showed you what the dark art stuff looks like, that's from that site as well. Um, some great products on there, some great sauces, great pickles. Alright, if you like the videos you know what to do, um, it will be appreciated and um, leave a comment for me and I'll get back to you and as I explained in my last video out in that thunderstorm, uh, you may not have seen that one. Um, some of you I only just got back to and you, you messaged me a couple of weeks ago, even up to three weeks ago, I didn't get those comments, they're, they're put on hold for a review and uh, luckily I used TubeBuddy and um, we've got a comments section and your comments have been sitting in there for two or three weeks. Um, so I apologise, I haven't got back to you, I didn't see anything offensive on those uh, comments, I don't know why they've been put on hold or up for a review, um, perhaps the odd swear word but it's nothing nothing offensive at all, um, just a laugh, um, anyway I have to then uh, allow you to make comments to my, on my comments section, um, on my page, so I've done that. Um, and I'll have to check that more often so that uh, you don't think I'm ignoring you and being ignorant. Um, I do appreciate your subscriptions and um, your nice comments you leave me and um, that's what keeps me going, that's why I do it, you know. Um, so yeah, I'll keep an eye on that and I promise I'll get back to you a lot quicker. Anyway, that was my review on, uh, I don't think I've forgotten anything. Did you also wanted to say? Well, um, Polytunnel's on its way, um, as from tomorrow, so next week uh, Chris and I will be building it and um, we'll shoot a couple of videos, we'll probably have a bit of a laugh along the way, so hopefully I can get all my potting up done the following weekend and um, you'll see some big plants happening out there and uh, some pods growing because I'm way behind what with this pandemic and all that, way behind with everything, waiting for stuff to turn up and um, you know, it is what it is this year, um, but there will be plenty of peppers and a few funny reviews and all that. Anyway, I've been TJ Burns. I'll see you on the next video. Thank you all.